Hey guys, um, hopefully this angle is good, I don't know. Um, so I'm back. <laughs> okay, so literally I hopped in bed and was not gonna go to the post office. So then like, I got a picture of like, um, the doll Chateau Evangeline. Um, you can check this on my Instagram. But um, Chateau finished the face up and literally I was gagging. And so I was just so inspired and just I don't know I just kept on like going through like um, all the stuff that I wanted to make and stuff and then like I got the text message that the heads arrived so I was just like mm, I gotta go to the post office so I have uh, well there was five packages but I already opened two of them so one of them was my backdrop let me switch you guys back a little bit so you can see I don't know if you guys remember I had the, uh, the brick wall but now I have this more elegant looking backdrop. Uh, it's not done. I mean, I still have to uh, get some like plants and stuff and I'm trying to get this table um, and a chandelier. So yeah, but um, I'm trying to change everything to be darker. I also need to uh, paint the clothing racks black because they're like a light wood color. But yeah, I just need to change that. Um, sorry, let me just get you guys centered. Is that, I don't know, hopefully that's centered fine all right so like I told you guys before oh I don't know if I'm gonna post this today mm, mm, I don't know it depends but uh, I'm gonna post the other one uh, the, the what was it I don't really know why I'm saying this because you're probably gonna see that one first then you're gonna see this one so it doesn't matter I'm gonna post that other video and then maybe post this if I have time later today or tomorrow so yeah okay so uh, here goes this wig. I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, Sleepy, Sleepy, Sheepy Dreams. Um, so sh sh he or she, um, she, I don't know, um, makes really, really, really cute, adorable minifee wigs. So hopefully <laughs> this wig fits um, the lily cat head um, because I did looked at the measurements and she did mention that the wig cap is stretchy. So hopefully, fingers crossed. And then this box here is the three heads that I sent. Well, two of them I sent and then one of them he was holding. And then I was just like, you know, since it's there, do it anyways. So it became three face-ups. So that's that. And then I just got this in the mail. So these are... <clears throat> okay, so uh, really quick. Um, oh, these are shoes. I'll show you in a second. Um, so my character... Uh, his, his name is Zizel, but I call him Tay because it's it was part of the story, but I'm thinking um, he's not going to have this name. It's, it's confusing if you don't know what I'm talking about, but he was supposed to have this name change thing that happened in the story, but I decided against it, so he's just going to have his normal name. So it's Zizel. It's spelled Z-A-I-Z-E-L, but um, you can just say Zai, Z-A-I, or if you want, you can still call him Tay, but... If you hear me say Zizel, then that's what I'm talking about. But anyways, so his shoes came in. Um, I bought him these, um, and I bought him another one, um, and then I bought her a pair. So these were, <laughs> ciao, these are expensive AF, but I really, really wanted them. So I wear creepers myself in real life, um, and I was like, hmm, why can't my dolls have creepers? And I thought these were really, really cute, so I got these. Um, yeah. They're, they look a little big, but I know they'll fit. Oh, let me bring him down here. I don't know why he left him up there. But he's currently headless because I'm about to put his head back on. Um, this is what I normally keep him in. I love these sneakers. Um, they're the New Balances that I told you guys that I got. But, uh, yeah, he's going to be wearing these regularly. I freaking, freaking look. These, I think, would be adorable with some shorts and then, like, a button-up shirt that's, like, short sleeve. He has one, actually over there and then like um a tie maybe or something like kind of like that school school boy bad boy look um yeah i think these would be amazing for that um hmm, okay so i'm gonna open this probably last because um he told me that he reinforced the box and everything inside so uh usually i open things before i um start filming but i wanted to have like this element of surprise for myself so i didn't um open it like at all so I'm gonna open the wig really quick. Okay, right off the bat, I was so excited. Like, 
uh, when I went to the post office and she started like handing me all my packages and stuff. So I saw this. I'm gonna let me tear it off of this. I don't wanna damage it. I saw this um this little card with a picture of what is it, what is it called? Um I don't remember the name of her doll. Um I don't I feel like I'm gonna get it wrong. Is it Mar no. I don't know, but uh Mar Mar Marma I feel like I'm confusing her with someone else, but um, if you remember the name of her, uh, write it in the comments. Uh, I think her name starts with an M. Damn it, I can't remember. But um, yeah, so I saw this picture and I was so excited because like, you know, the wig is here. And so she said she would include um, a brush to brush it. So this, I love this. Like, you guys know, I collect everything like this. Like, I never showed you guys, I don't think I did, the little box I have. Like, I literally save everything. Like, all these cards and stuff. Like, there's, it doesn't look like a lot, but there's a lot of things in here. Because, like, I save literally everything. So, put that in there. And then, this cute little bag. So, it comes with uh, this, um, like, you know those uh, eyelash applicators you can get at, like, Sephora? Um, for, like, so you don't get germs and stuff. Um, so, that's to brush the wig. Uh, I think this is just something cute to have. And then she included this. I have so many of these for uh, Takiya because he always has his hair twisted up. And then, thank you for the purchase, Sheepy. Says that. And cute little kittens. Um, and there's some, I think these are cherry blossoms or something on the side of this little bag. And then stickers, you know I'm a sucker for stickers. Hold on. So she has a lot of cutesy, oh, and then this little thing. I already have these. <laughs> it's funny that she gifted these, I already have them. Okay, so there's a little cake, and then there's a cat. I do not know what that is. Is that a needle on this back? I think that's a needle. Okay, I don't know, no, I don't know what that means. Um, and then this is a bunny with a beanie. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so I tried changing my lighting again. So I do not know if it's going to affect this video, but hopefully not. Okay, let me just put everything back in this bag so we can put it away. Okay. So now for the wig. You guys, my heart just skipped. Okay, so it's smaller than I thought it would be. Um, like I thought it would be more like like out, like, but it's in this cute little wrapping. It is so tiny. I'm so nervous. It's not that thick. I thought it'd be like super, super thick. Okay, here it is. So it's like a brown to pink ombre. Ooh. Okay. Maybe it's the net that's wrapping up. It says Sleepy Wigs, Choco Berry. Um, this is alpaca wig. Oh my gosh, it is so soft, you guys. It is. Dude, it is so freaking socks so I actually made a, a white wig uh, for uh, Sunny uh, out of alpaca um, that's soft like this and I actually hated it because um, it was so hard it wasn't hard to work with it was just it's like you can't really comb it because it's so soft it could get tangled very easy um, but this Y'all, this is so freaking soft. Are you kidding me? I am sh I am shook. I am effing shook, you guys. Look at that. Like, maybe it's made. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. <laughs> maybe it's made. What are their um those hair commercials? You know when they're um talking about a conditioner and then they like show you the little um scientific whatever and then they like do like a close up on the hair and then the girl she puts her hands to her hair or the stylist puts the hands to the hair and they do that shit y'all this right here i can't i'm i'm so shocked right now because it does not look this soft in the pictures i actually thought it was gonna be a hard wig or something i'm so shocked <laughs> okay so the head is um the intended head for this wig is in this box so let me just uh try to open it for you really quick okay so i actually bought eyes for the lily cat i bought the um what is it solina box dolls um it's so funny y'all because <laughs> i'm thinking like a couple months ago when i uh well not a couple months ago like last year when i saw that shop on etsy um i was like 
uh, $32 for some eyes? Child, please. Like, I will never spend um, that much for some eyes. And like, look at look at here I am. Like, I'm like, you know, all, all for it now. So I actually bought the, the Shangri-La eyes. So it's like a purple, pink um, color. So I thought it would be really cute. Because this was before I saw that wig. So I was um, gonna commission um, Moderately Vivid to make a pink wig or something, like a black to pink. Um, oh my gosh, this is, <laughs> he was not kidding. I was gonna commission, commission them to do a black to pink. All right, so there's the three heads. A black to pink, and um, I was like, okay, I might as well just buy the wig now. And, um, and basically, I bought the eyes, and then literally, I think a couple days later, I saw um, that wig, and I was like, mm, sold. Literally the moment I saw it. All right, let me show you the eyes I'm talking about really quick. Okay, so I'm gonna have to cover her the face up because I don't want you guys to get spoiled. But I don't know if I can show you guys. Ah. Okay. Um. Of course not. I mean, you could kind of see, but it's like the center is pink and the outer edge is like purple. I don't know if you could. Oh, I almost spoiled this face up. I don't know if you can see that. I'm sorry. Like. I tried. All right, I don't know who's who. Um, okay, so I'm pretty sure this is the Heliot because I told them I was really afraid that the, the ears might break. Um, oh, did I not show you guys? I don't think I posted that video. I did assume Heliot box opening, but then I didn't post it for some reason because I just felt like it was meh. So, yeah, got him. Um, and yeah, I was just like, I was so nervous that. I was so nervous that it was gonna uh, get damaged, so they like turned it into like a little ball. Okay, <sighs> you guys, I do not know if he put lashes, cause I usually he does. Like you don't have to tell him, but I didn't ask this time. Okay, he didn't put lashes, so I'm gonna have to put the lashes myself then. Um, okay, <gasps> it looks so good. It looks so good. Okay. All right, so. This is her. I, I, I specifically wanted um, her to have this, so I actually drew it out. So let me show you my reference. I never post these. I always plan out like what I want the um, the face up to look like. Um, come on. All right, found it. Um, there it is. So this was my plan. Hold on. This is my plan for. Are you serious? Let me put the brightness down. That's probably what it is. This is my plan of what I wanted her to look like. There you go. Sheesh. Okay, so this is what I wanted her to look like. And so this is what he did. What do you guys think? I think it's amazing, spot on. Um, so I'm gonna see what the curls look like with her wig on. All right. Um, uh, also, this is like the company face up, the, um, the Lily Cat company face up. And then I just told him to just darken the features cause she had like really light eyebrows. And then she had like very sparse eyelashes, so I told him to darken that and all that. Um, and then, yeah, I just basically add the hair. So let me put her out. I hit my elbow. That hurt. Let me put her on her body. Oh, this is a. This is just her temporary clothes for now. Like, so I want her to be in skirts and stuff. So actually, this is a skirt that I bought, um, and I basically made it fit her waist with some velcro like don't even look at the back it's ratchet <laughs> and then this top um it kind of looks like it fits doesn't it i mean it's kind of loose it's not as tight i would i mean i like it I, I like it let me stop complaining i am such an egg hold on let me just get my tool really quick all right so i'm going to pop her on he put little little popcorns inside their head all right i'm gonna pop her head on Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, so I commissioned um, Moderately Vivid to make two wigs, one for um, Hashish, um, the one right there, um, and then one for Trinity, which you guys do not know yet, because literally I got her and then sent her away, so that's the um, Evangeline. <laughs> she looks like a little, a little schoolgirl or whatever. <gasps> Fingers crossed, you guys, I will cry if this is not fit. I will, I will literally cry. This is so well made, you guys. 
I will cry. It will fit, because I'm looking at it right now, and it's really, really big. And she's a 7, 8, I think, her head. <sighs> fingers crossed, you guys, fingers crossed. I'm so, let me face her to me. I'm so nervous. I'm like, hella nervous. It's gonna fit, it's just a little fragile. Ah, I'm so nervous. Hold on, I don't wanna tear it. Oh, by the way, her name's on the inside. probably gonna have to um, work with this so I watched a uh, video by um, um, what's her name um, um, I'm having a brain fart moment by um, Sighthound Lady where she um, actually cut one of the wigs um, to make it fit and I was so ready to do that for this wig because I had to have it okay so I need to pull it forward a bit more hold on so it fits, it's just, um, it's just, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. I'll show you guys in a second. Okay, totally, like the curl, uh, I do not know how to position it. Should I position it to the side, or, sorry guys, one second. Should I position it to the side? Maybe I should position it to the side. That way? Oh yeah, that's, that's much better. Okay, much better. Okay. But the curl is kind of like hidden. I mean, what do you, <laughs> you guys are so high. Let me try to lower you guys a bit. Okay. There you go. What do you guys think? So her eyes are not here, so she has no eyes at, at the moment. She's gonna be soulless. Um, try to, I don't know. So the curls, the curls were supposed to be, cause her, her hair, ooh, her hair texture, like I intended for it to be, um, for it to be curly, like, like black girl, natural curly hair, like very textured. But then I saw this wig and I was like, yeah, I gotta have it. So, and she's the only one in my crew that has pink hair. So I wanted her to have it. I don't know what you guys think. I feel like the curl kind of ruins it. She has like a, a little Superman. It's like her hair is bone straight and then she has like a Superman curl. Maybe I should give her curls or something. I don't know. She looks nice. It fits her, which is amazing. Um, so there's that. It fits. Um, yeah, you guys. That was that was that wig. Okay. Yeah, it fits. Sorry, I'm like a little little speechless right now because she looks really really good. Okay, it, it works on the side. I mean, there you go, cute little curl on the side. That's cute, right? I think so. Yeah. There you go. Or that little clip thing. Mm, I kind of don't want to clip it because it's gonna leave like a, a clip mark or something. But yeah, that's her. I mean, the curls on the side work. The one in the in the front, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna push her to the side because I'm spending too much time on her. Oh, she's so adorable, you guys. I just need her to have her eyes. Yeah, she looks really good. Okay, anyways, moving on. So this is, I'm gonna butcher this name. Um, it's a Korean name. Yigun, 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 I don't know. Don't laugh at me. Okay, so this is the Soul Doll head. Um, so this is a certificate. So I bought this from him and then I was gonna sell it. Um, I still feel like selling it because I don't really need the extra head, but I really, really wanted the sculpt at the time. I should've, um, I should've um, bought it from Sold All when they were doing the head sale with everyone else, but I, I just, I don't know, I just didn't. So here he is. Actually, now that he's here, I could probably try and see if Sol the Sold All head would have worked on this body <laughs> nope nope look at that strong ass neck nope no freaking way oh my gosh maybe i don't even know i don't know 
Okay, so I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this this sculpt because I don't need it, but I really like this sculpt. I don't know. If you're interested, sold all. Um, y e g u n. You guys. So um, yeah. See that okay? What I'm most excited for is the Heliod. I don't even know how to approach this. <laughs> um, okay, all right. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. I can't take my eyes off her. Um, hold on, y'all. I'm like fumbling the lyrics to the song. Damn, there's two layers. There's like so much rapping on my floor right now. Okay, so we're almost there. His two ears are right here. Um, okay, so uh, this face up, there's a funny story behind this. So <laughs> literally, I micromanaged the F out of like him while he was making this. And it's like, I don't normally do that. Normally, like with her, I didn't micromanage at all. I was just like, you know, do this, do that, and then at some points he shows you um, progress pics, and then like you can be like, oh yeah, I like that, or change that a little bit or something. But for this one, like, I needed it to be perfect, like perfect. Because um, I don't know if you guys know, but Heliot is my all-time favorite sculpt. Um, assume Heliot, and. Um, he's one of my main characters in my story, um, along with um, Alex, or Alexander, but I call him Alex, um, who's the Long Soul Eleven. And I basically needed him to be perfect. I will show you um, my uh, drawing of him, of what, how I wanted him to look. So before I show you guys his head, let me actually show you guys that. Um, I was hoping it was in the folder, but I'm gonna have to dig for it. Um, 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 um. Sorry, guys. I don't know where it is. Um, somewhere here. I feel like I went too far. Did I? Mm, I went too far. Sorry, one second. I really want to show you guys. I literally had this in the folder, but I deleted it. Where is this? Um, I know it's here somewhere. Hold on. Oh, I think I passed it. Okay, I'm at the BJD retreat. Like, no, or not retreat. Um, doll meet. So I know I went way too far. Ah, y'all just like, bitch. We don't care. <laughs> Hold on, you guys. Okay, uh, I know it's nearby. Where is it? Where is it? Uh, I see all these uh, familiar photos. Wait, I'm almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Oh my goodness. Are you serious? I was just looking at this like literally um, last night. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, found it. Sheesh, that took way too long. Okay, so this is his character. Y'all was like, oh, that was worth the wait. Um, so this is what his character is supposed to look like. So, um, yeah. So I don't know if you guys remember what he used to look like, um, but this is what he's supposed to look like. At least his real form. Okay, so now, moving on. You're about to see him. Okay, so I was so satisfied with the photos. So, here he is. Um... It's kind of hard to see, but he has a tattoo on the side of his head, and then his tattoo is here. This <laughs> this whole thing was a struggle, y'all. Like, literally, I was just like, okay, that looks good, but fix that. That Like, yeah. I felt so bad, um, but, like, in the end, I was like, okay, uh, how much? And then I paid him a little bit extra because I felt bad. But, I mean, he didn't seem upset, and I... I I apologize the whole time like every time I was like sorry I'm so sorry I know you're working hard blah, blah, blah. but um, I just need him to be perfect so um yeah he's not done because uh, oh, this magnet stupid magnet keeps on acting up he's not done but um, yeah I need to um, 
add some shimmer like I do with everyone. Like usually, whenever I get uh, a doll, I always uh, do a little something to it. But um, yeah, here he is. He doesn't have any eyes either. Like the eye Well, he does have eyes, but not the eyes that I want for him. Okay. So let me go a little bit higher. Okay. There you go. So I plan to make his wig myself because I'm just that meticulous about his the sculpt, like everything about it, I need to micromanage. So I, I know I wouldn't be able to stand somebody doing the wig because I want it to be perfect. So I don't know, okay, I took it apart. So this is his old wig. I don't know if you guys remember, but like it was like very, um, is that called frayed? I don't know. It was like very tapered, frayed, whatever in the back. And then he had the two long bangs, but um, I, I was washing some um, new fiber that I had and um, decided, you know, why not like recycle this wig since I'm gonna make a new one anyways um, and make him basically a new one to accommodate his ears. But yeah, so here's actually uh, the fiber. I don't know if it's enough. I started preparing some more, but this is what I have for now. So literally right after I'm, um, I'm done with this video, I'm gonna start on his wig, but yeah. It's like black. I'm thinking maybe I'm gonna, so you know how he has like the two long bangs? I'm thinking maybe I'm going to um, bleach them and then dye the tips like maybe a red or a purple or something. Or uh, icy gray or what, I don't know. I just want to give him some color maybe. Um, but yeah, so that's that's basically all I have for you guys. Um, I'm just really excited to get to work. He's so super washed out. I don't know if you can, he's so super washed out. Oh my gosh, you're not gonna have any soul for a while. She's not gonna have eyes. He's not gonna have eyes. Um, but yeah, that's that's basically these two. Um, and like I said, I don't think I will be keeping the Yigen, but yeah. So that's him. That's her. Oh, names, names, names. So it's I don't think I told you guys her name because it took me a while. I was I was stuck on um, I was stuck on Layla for a while. Uh, I think it's because I was watching a lot of Star Wars, but <laughs> I was stuck on Layla for a while. But something about that name, like it, it never stuck for me. And then I was thinking of Avery or Audrey or something. But now I was like, eh, that's like I like it. I like, wanted her to have something unique, but like it was just I wasn't feeling it. And then um, what was the other name? It was something else. Uh, Eleanor. I was like, oh, I like Eleanor. That's a cute name. But then I was like, no. How about like Normani or something? and she ended up keeping that name so um i, I think i was just gonna call her like norman for short or something or nora or something but her name is normani and then like i said for him his name is zizel so yeah oh and then trinity you guys don't know her yet actually let me show you that actually reminded me so um let me show you her um her face up that i was able to get a peep of um it's com completed so um she just needs to send it over my way from um, Canada. So Mint Chateau is the one I did the face up. So that's her. I freaking love it, you guys. Um, so that's uh, basically her her face. And then um, let me show you her wig really quick. Well, actually the two wigs that I commissioned. Um, I commissioned Moderately Vivid. So basically it's hers is like a, a ash green, ash gray. Um, so it's gonna look like this, um, that's her wig, and then for Sheesh, his is going to be, um, basically the wig he has on now, but just, um, made of alpaca. So this is the, um, that's the Ring Doll Jack the Ripper wig, um, I kept it to this day, um, so he's just gonna have this hair, but basically, um, alpaca. And, Cause he's supposed to have like like he's supposed to have like the um, elegant uh, clothing like he wears like fucking like proper clothes like a tailcoat and like um, a dress shirt and a vest or something like dress shoes and then like he he has his glasses so actually he has like these circular glasses that he's wearing right now which is because I don't have like I didn't buy the new ones yet but I plan to do that um, this week so he needs to have like these like really big specs and then a watch and then maybe maybe a tie or something i don't know but um yeah i, I added up his whole wardrobe like just the basic 
thing and it was like almost 100 bucks so i was like whoa <laughs> so um yeah i need to get him that um i do not know when the wigs um are gonna be finished but uh he said that commission should be done like this like november so hopefully that he like that happens but um yeah tell me guys what you guys think about um all these new things i was really excited um uh oh that kind of creeped me out <laughs> i thought for a second that um i don't know like she had like something in her head but that's just her um the ring but yeah that kind of that kind of looked creepy okay let me just hide it there and eh, right there but yeah so this is a mini fee wig you guys um this is a seven eight um and it fits which is really awesome this wig was made by sleepy sheepy dreams and then like i said the face-ups were done um oh i didn't say his name k-o-a-c-o-m-i i do not know how to pronounce that never did um probably never will but yeah that's him and these shoes i got for i want to say 38 Ooh, they were pretty pretty pricey but i, I really love them um so i got I got these and then I got ones with um, white on the top and then I got female ones with just all black. So yeah, uh, probably gonna do a update video um, of his wig, um, Zyla's wig. And then, um, well there's some other wigs up there that, uh, who is it? Um, Zane, uh, I never showed you guys him, did I? I don't think I did. Let me show you him really quick. So. I made him this wig um, earlier, or was it earlier this month or last month? I feel like I made it either late September or early October, but this is for um, for uh, a pumpkin patch doll meet that I went to. So yeah, because you know he has his um, his undercut thing going on. Um, so I made him this and um, I really, really liked it. So I decided he would keep it. Oh, don't mind the one gauge. I accidentally broke his gauge. So I'm in the process of making him a new one. So he's currently uh, has one gauge right now. But um, yeah, so basically uh, he's, in my opinion, out of all my dolls, he's like the only one right now that's kind of, like, kind of complete. Like he has really um, like nice eyes. He has um, the Ico. I don't know what color this is actually. I don't know. This might be the 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 D D descent or what, I don't know how to pronounce it. It might be that one or it might be like um, some type of blue or something. But um, he has Ico eyes um, and then this really nice wig that I like. Like I feel like this is a look for his character. Like I feel like he's complete. He just doesn't have a wardrobe um, right now. These are some pants that were given to me by my friend. Bought these shoes on uh, the secondhand market. Um, and then this is a cotton honey shirt. And then um, he has some some marble boxers that I commissioned by Coffee Creations. But um, I mean, he had a wardrobe, but then like I went through this period when I was like, okay, I'm not gonna keep him. And then I ended up selling some of the things, but then like I decided, no, I'll keep him. So like now it's like, well, fuck, I don't have any clothes for him. So he's gonna be in this for a while. So bear with that, you guys. Um, and then also my girls, all my girls need a wardrobe. Like they have a wardrobe, but it's like not character specific. So I don't really consider it wardrobe. Um, and I need to make an F ton of chokers for everyone um, and jewelry. Like I've been really lazy about that. Um, but here's some of my work, if you can, can see. But um, yeah, so, and then Takiel has, um, who is it? Uh, Zod, Zod's old, old wig. So I don't know if you guys remember him, but it was like that really black. Like he was a, the, the, what is it, doll? Doll she. It, he was a doll she Raymond, and um, yeah, I made him that one black wig, and he had the bandana around his head. Um, so yeah, that's what he has right now, but I want to commission Moderately Vivid to make a really, really long one. Either I commission or I make it myself, I don't know, it depends on how I feel, if I'm feeling lazy or whatever. But I want to have like that basically samurai look where it's like really, really long hair, and then the one little ponytail or something, and then like the like side bang to the side or whatever. So I really want that for him. But um, I'm satisfied with that for now. I mean, it's just the length. I just want it to be longer, that's it. There's not really anything wrong with the wig. Um, so if I do end up selling that, um, I'll probably post it on my Instagram. 
Um, and then Jackson, I'm probably gonna send him um, back to get an, um, his face up redone because he has a tattoo on the side of his face that I'm not really feeling. So I wanna get that removed. Um, I do not know if I'll do that. This I was planning on doing it, like sending him out this week, but maybe, maybe, I don't know, it all depends. Uh, I'm just gonna wait. And then Hashish, uh, like I said, his wig is being made. So basically, oh, <laughs> so my brother-in-law just did a thing um, for my birthday, he, well, I don't know how it came up, but I was just like, um, yeah, so, because they like to know, like, him and my sister like to know, like, what I'm doing in the hobby and stuff, and, like, how everything's going, and basically, we were just, like, talking, and then out of nowhere, um, she was like, oh, you should get her something for her birthday, like, you haven't seen her in, like, years, and then I was like, oh, yeah, you should give me something doll-related, like, I was like, hmm, hmm, hmm. And um, I was like, holy shit, like, yeah, doll related. And I was like, you know what? You should get me some really, really nice doll eyes. And then he's like, okay. Um, and I was like, oh, really? And he was like, yeah, how much are the eyes? I was like, oh, they're like 32 bucks. And he's like, okay. And I was like, okay, uh, throw in a wig. And he's like, okay. And I was like, he was like, how much was the wig? Or how much is the wig? And I was like, um, it's like 120 bucks and he was like oh, oh damn uh, all right that that's fine and i was like really and i was like okay if you're gonna do eyes and a wig then you might as well just say like i was like F it. you might as well just do like all eyes so he was like okay, okay sure fine and so um uh, the plan was to get me like four eyes but then he ended up just sending me like the money like he was supposed to send it to me in january because that's what my birthday is but he was like um you know whatever i'll just send it to you now and i was actually really shocked that he sent because when he was like yeah i sent it and i was like what and he's like yeah i sent you the the money and i was like i was like are you serious and i looked at in my account and i was like wow he really did send it to me so um with that being said i plan to do a really big order of eyes i'm just not sure what i want like i know what i want but then like i'm trying to I'm not trying to rush and buy the eyes. I want to basically explore my options. So I want to see like, you know, it's like I really like Ico eyes, but then I want something that's like, it has like depth and dimension. So I really like the um, the Solina Box doll eyes. Um, but then, like, I don't know. Um, there's this uh, seller, um, or not seller, there's this uh, artist or something um, from Beijing on, um, uh, on Instagram that makes really really nice eyes and they said that they were going to do a um, overseas like order thing or whatever um, on the 30th and today is the 31st and the post is still not um, out yet so I'm kind of impatient because they need eyes and I know things like that take time so I want to order it quick so it can get to me before the end of the year so um, if probably if, if they don't post anything today I'm either gonna do um, the $150 uh, or not that probably like $200 of um, Solina, Solina box doll eyes or um, the Ico eyes but I'm not sure because with the Ico eyes it's like um, I think they're like 16 20 20 dollars a pair of eyes so um, either I do I could do like probably maybe like uh, eight almost ten eyes of Ico eyes or I can do um, I think six uh, Solina box doll eyes. So I'm just so conflicted, you guys. I, I know for sure, for a fact, I do want the film noir um, for the Solina box doll. I want the film noir. I want the, um, what is it called? The, uh, 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 what is it? I can't remember. It's like the green one. It's like a green and like brownish orange in the center. Um, Old Spice. Um, the film noir, Old Spice. I want Valhalla. Um, and maybe frayed denim, um, yeah. And then I wanted to get Mako eyes for Zaisla. I wanted to get the, um, I don't remember the number, but it's like the really white one. Um, but then I saw the overseas, like the Beijing eye person, and then I was like, oh my gosh, these are really nice. They were like 45 bucks, but I was like, damn, like they're really nice. Um, so, like I said, if they don't post anything soon, then I'm just gonna get the like the other eyes. Um, but I just, I don't know. So I'm just like all over the place right now. I'm like in this, I'm in this space where I'm just like getting rid of everything to get new stuff. Cause like, I just need, I need change. If I don't have change, I'm gonna get bored with this ho the hobby. So yeah, expect to see a lot of change you guys. Um, yeah, that's, that's it. That's all I have for you guys. Um, new things coming, um, new dollies, hopefully before the end of the year. If not, then probably early January, early February. Um, and 
and basically yeah that's it um so i hope this wasn't too long this was supposed to be like a 15 20 minute video and i ended up rambling at the end so sorry but um that's all i have for you guys hope you enjoyed Bye. all right really quickly i'm back i totally forgot to show you guys um his shoes like putting put them on y'all <laughs> You guys didn't see my first reaction because uh, the camera wasn't rolling, but I was out here yelling all types of yeses and shit, but um, yeah, so he has like his little um, anklets and stuff. This is so adorable. I cannot. Um, I would love to see him with shorts on with these. Oh, um, so I got like a bunch of like little accessories. So he has um, um, these really nice quality um, suspender thingies, um, like really, really nice quality. Oh, he also has boxers made by um, Co-Opa Creations. But yeah, they're like floral. Um, and then I got uh, Trinity, a really, really nice choker. Um, but I decided not to put it on her because I didn't want to lose it. But yeah, look at these effing shoes. Uh, I cannot. I need to uh, commission someone to make him some fitted socks. Um, because like this whole like loose nonsense, like I can't, I need it to be... I need it to be tight. I need it to be really tight. I, mean, I could probably make it myself. I'm too lazy. Um, but yeah, man. And look, his little rainbow thing. I cannot. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm I'm gone now. I'm really gone. All right. Bye.